Welcome back to the channel. It's day four of our road trip to Prince Edward Island, Canada. It's going to be an action packed day today as we head to New Glasgow to check out the beautiful Butterfly House. What an amazing experience. Then it's over to Cavendish where we're going to have some fun on the boardwalk and maybe even get a tattoo. For lunch, we're going to hit Avonlea Village where we may have had the best lobster roll on the island. Then, before heading home, we decided to stop into Sandspit Amusement Park. Dave and I might never recover from that old rickety roller coaster. Before the night's over, the family comes in with an amazing find. Something washed up on our beach, but you'll have to watch to see what it is. If you like this kind of content, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Today, we are going to try to get out by 9 a.m. and we're going to head to Cavendish today. So, I'm not sure if anybody's been to Cavendish before in Prince Edward Island, but we are looking forward to it. We've been there a couple of times, but we've never really fully explored the area. So, apparently, there's a lot to do, a lot to see. We may also hit a beach, not sure. I know that the girls want to go to the Great Canadian Soap Shop, which isn't in Cavendish, but maybe it's on the way. Anyway, should be a good day. Okay, Mama, what do we got going on today? Today we are going to drive into Cavendish and check that out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was that up here? Are you playing a game? Yes. Mm -hmm. I heard some crazy sounds up here. This is the chicken wolf from Dreamland. <laughs> Chicken wolf. It bites you. I got it. It also eats it. It also eats its chicken winger. Chicken wing. <laughs> chicken winger. <laughs> chicken wing finger. To reach an HP. Now quick, before we go, we must play a bar. Oh boy, I have no idea about these guys. <laughs> Did you like the lingonberry? Yes, it was very delicious. Yeah. Luca found some uh, lingonberry jelly that he likes. Wow. Oh my gosh, there you go, that's good. Gooseberry? Alright. How's that one? Good. Real dumb. Just yeah. raspberry, wild blueberry and raspberry. Ooh. How are you? Oh, good, how are you? I'm great, thanks. Good. There we are. Perfect. So this is the Garden of Hope. We just walked through the PEI uh, Preserve Company. It was really cool. They had some great preservatives and uh, spices and local artisan works, really nice. Now this garden is um, maintained by donation and um, we're gonna check it out. If you move the rock, it's gonna go out. It might be good, maybe go back to the inside. Those are roses, Luca. Look, they smell. They smell, but they're very fragrant. Mm. Nice. Yeah, it's beautiful. Don't be snatching the grass. You don't need to snatch. See, this the stuff they like. Let go, honey, let go. 
crunchy crunch. <laughs> oh my goodness. His name is Oliver the goat. There's a, a soap a soap company that we've been to where they have goats yeah. and they actually feed them the, the pine, pine needles. Yeah. It must be a thing they like. Though. They must like it. Doesn't seem like it's a good texture. Hey, we are now at the Butterfly House here in, I believe, New Glasgow, Prince Edward Island. We are about to enter. Here we go. It is so beautiful in here. It's a small little enclosure, but these, I've not seen these species before. They're so beautiful. I love the blue ones. And of course you can grab little orange pieces and they come and, and eat from the orange. It's really nice. This place is awesome. I mean, we're having a blast. Luca had a little hitchhiker on his shoulder, was following him around. He got the Starry Night on his orange, which he really wanted to get, because I think that's his favorite. So, one of Luca's butterflies uh, pooped on, and uh, it was like he was blessed with the nectar of the gods. <laughs> He's never gonna change his shorts. It fell on his shorts. <laughs> Hey fam, so what'd you think of the butterfly house? Awesome. That was very special. I love all the different types. Yeah. What was your favorite? The blue morpho. Yeah. I think mine too. All right. Okay, so now we're in Cavendish, and this is the boardwalk. This place is really busy. They got lots of little shops, little eateries, some kids stuff, uh, toy store, arcade, stuff like that. But it's definitely tourist uh, stop number one when you hit Cavendish. So we're gonna check it out. Okay, so I just got an airbrush tattoo. You know, while I was on a hike, a little cougar came out and he got my calf. You like it? Yeah. Awesome. I hope it it wears off soon that it looks awful. Yeah. It looks like it hurts. It's a wound. Painful. Yeah. Yo. Yeah. Mm. Oh. 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 Alright. <laughs> Scorpion. It looks like Here we go. Okay, we can't get all day. <laughs> I think I have to walk through. Yeah. Whoa. 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 Whoa.
think you like it? Oh, nice. We got it. It's basically in the same spot. Hacky sack. Woo! He almost hit me on the head. There you have it. Now that is the master of the hacky sack. <laughs> what are you the master of? I'm master of being boring. <laughs> what? Of what? The master of being boring. This is Balladium. It's a competition. The dads are definitely going to win. There's a one It's a competition. <laughs> you hit the targets, not dads. Go! Shoot the targets. Hey, we're at Avonlea Village. Really cool spot here. It's free to come and it's got some shops, little boutiques, a coffee shop, and some restaurants, I believe. We've never been here before, so we're excited to check it out. I can't do that. You can. No. You're getting ready. So. You're really good with all that stuff. I can do like well, basic stuff. <laughs> oh yeah. I think it's okay. Is that okay? Oh, oh. Yeah. Is it okay if you're on camera? Oh me? <laughs> like a PI. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, that is a cute one. Nice. Eh? I have the map. You have the map. The light. You go in there. So cute here. I love all the outdoor seating they have. Lots of nice little spots to eat. A couple of cute shops, a really nice art shop. They also have the Anna Green Gables Chocolate Company, so that's good. And they have cows ice cream, so that'll probably be our dessert again. I was just curious, how do two women stay in a shop that's the size of a bathroom for that long? It's art. <laughs> it was beautiful things in there. Gorgeous. Yeah. Really how gorgeous. How come you came out empty handed? Because the ones out, they're expensive. Yeah. Mm. Everything's over $300. Like, what I like is about 900 Because I wanted, to, I told mm. Dave I wanted to get a larger piece mm. this time because I was get the mm. small ones. Mm. Oh my God, there's two, three beautiful ones. Mm. They're all about a thousand bucks. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> but one good thing is, Dave, she's got expensive tastes and she found you and was like, oh, that's my man. <laughs> 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 Dave's PI <PM> lobster roll. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm, re I'm ready to order. You ready to and order? We'll, and then we'll put it on. This guy doesn't mess around. No, it's on the side. Oh, on the side. Okay. <laughs> yep. That's a little chive. Yeah, and oh, do you want onions on? Do you want chives? Mm hmm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a big one. So Thank exciting. You. Thank you so much. Okay, hold on. 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 Let me just wander Hold on, please. You can take the this so that if you drop it, you can have it on there. You want this one? Okay. Sure. Have we fried that one yet? How is it, Mom? Very yummy. Luca. <laughs> okay, the lobster rolls at Dave's. 
Dave's lobster, awesome. All three of us had the, the local and larger. And everybody had that actually, except Teo, he had a half and half. He had half a local and half a fancy, which was warm lobster with maybe some warm butter, lemon juice. I have been informed, lemon juice. And the potato salad was delicious. It was very unique, but so flavorful. Delectable. Delectable. It was really stuffed with lobster, mm -hmm. so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's I love the mix, the lobster, the chive. The celery. You have to go to Dave's Lobster. <laughs> yeah, boy. Yeah. No good. matter where you live, yeah. you have to. All right. And get the large lobster rule. The my local. Top, this, that's my top two favorite place to eat lobster. Really? Part of your top two? It's probably my top two. Wow. Now look at Dave is uh, doing well, some like, <laughs> some oh, horticultural no, activities. Plantology. <laughs> He's an arborist. Yeah. Can we do a squashy? Yeah. Okay. Pull it says, right? Pull. Is it good? So good. Is that? Okay, we're at Sandspits Amusement Park here in Cavendish, Prince Edward Island. We're basically gonna do the um, the go karts, and then we're probably gonna go to the beach. But we'll just see uh, what's going on in here. So let's check it out. Okay, so that was the go-karts. I like, I'm gonna have to say, I mean, I definitely did the best. I started in fifth place, sixth place, and I ended up there in, well, first place. What? And uh, yeah, I lapped Zia uh, like twice, her and Luca. And Teo, he drove himself for the first time ever, so that was pretty big. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Boys, how are the bumper boats? Amazing. They're also called blaster boats. Yeah, well, they're there not you called go. bumper. All right, you did good. I remember that it was not called bumper, but I did not remember what it was actually called. Yeah. Hey, we are now gonna get on the cyclone. Woo! Oh Say it with Luca, you excited? Yeah! All right. Luca, bye for good.
gosh, it was good. great. What did you guys think? It was so fun. Yeah. I don't like that. The, that <laughs> like, it's a troll. You yeah. go up, yeah. and then it goes whoop, yeah. and then you go fit. Yeah. Well, Dave and I. I like the spinning turn. Dave and yeah, I, we I like went the, the first little zip. Both our spines went crack, crack. <laughs> <laughs>We had another amazing day, and I can't believe a week has literally gone by almost already. Tomorrow will be day six, and then basically Saturday would have been our checkout day if we had just stayed a week. So thankfully we got a second week, and uh, I'm not sure that we can afford the food for the second week though. Holy smokes. I mean, Disney trips are expensive, but uh, eating seafood every day in uh, Prince Edward Island, that's even more expensive. Tonight for dinner, we're gonna have some more dogs. Something quick, because we're hungry and tired. What happened? So, oh my gosh. You might not think this is true, but uh -huh. it is. Me and Mom were walking, and then we found a dead baby killer whale. Killer what? I think so, I swear I think so. Yeah, it has a blue hole. Where is it? It's at the freaking end. The top is black, the bottom is white, and the tail is not like a fish. It's like it's a it's a whale tail. What? Yes, it has a blue. It has a blue. It's okay, I gotta go see this. Okay, so this way. My family, we're doing a little night walk here before um, after dinner, room. and uh, I stayed back in the house to rest. And then they come back and they say they found a baby orca. So dead but I gotta go see this it better be a freaking orca oh my gosh it was so exciting we we're examining it it has a very like kind of like a stubbed nose like a an orca has a blue hole and the bottom of it is white and the top is like a dark gray black color ah. it's very exciting but you sure it's not a porpoise no and that's why I said to Luke I said it could be a porpoise but I don't think so because it was really dark and it, porpoises have a long nose right uh, yeah, it's not typically. This was like, it had no nose. Like, oh. Okay. No, no. Like a killer whale has no nose. So I don't know. I mean, I, mean, I don't know. He's taking more stuff alive. Yeah, look at him. He what jumps. Is he come on this side. side? You it totally has a whale tail. Oh my gosh. Can I flip it over? No. Right? Just hold on, honey. Oh. And see, it's got all these, it? like, things on it. And it's got the mouth of, like, a bat, right? Like uh -huh. a. Porpoise or it looks like a whale. It does. Some kind of whale. Yeah. I think it's a killer, but it's a whale. Okay, please. I don't even know if I can do this. Oh, it's really heavy. Yeah, it is. Aww. See, look, the blow spout. Look, blow spout. Oh my God. See? That's what I said. I told you. I told you. Wow. Oh my God. What? Just pecking at it. Is that crazy? Oh my gosh. Wow. Uh, Heavy, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. Zio, try. Try moving it. It's Poor like, thing. it's solid. It's a solid little thing. What is it? Okay, that's pretty crazy. Uh, we all jumped up, ran down the beach, and uh, it was, uh, what a beautiful little creature. It's so sad that it's dead, but I know, you know, it is what it is. It is nature, but um, it does look like a little orca. I don't know, I'm not a marine biologist, so, I mean, it could just be a porpoise. The nose doesn't look like it. The coloring doesn't look like it, but maybe they start out like that. I don't know, but know. it... Definitely has a whale tail and a blow spout. If you know, please comment in the comments and say what you think. Yeah, exactly. I know. Anybody recognize that or know what it is, let us know. That's crazy. I mean, this is the water we're playing and swimming in. I know it's the North Atlantic, so it can have anything and everything in it. And we are getting more great whites and things like that here. So anyway, that's crazy. Thanks so much for watching. Please, if you haven't already, like, and if you want to watch some more of these videos, subscribe. We got lots more content coming your way.